for, for, for time and keeping these things together. So we have got some new faces in here, so I'm going to reiterate the sort of the usual spiel, so apologies for going over this. But the purpose of the Yorkshire Cybersecurity Cluster is to bring together um, businesses, organisations and individuals with a vested interest in information security. So from an information security professional point of view, it's networking with peers that are in the information security field. It's okay, leave it open, it's fine, don't worry. I can, I can shout over the noise, it's fine. Um, Maybe close that one though, if that's okay. If that's okay. Thanks, Ellie. So to bring together professionals. So there are a number of information security professionals in the room that are CISOs that um, provide the information security services from everything from small businesses up to the large banks, insurance companies amongst the room, and also a number of vendors and providers. It's an open, transparent network, so it's about you actually working, how you can work together um, and collaborate together. So everything as I say that, that we're doing today will be recorded this way, not that way, so don't worry, anything you say won't, won't be captured on, on camera, but that's so that we can share the knowledge. So the Yorkshire Cybersecurity Cluster has been going for a number of years. We have over sort of 200, uh, sorry, 450 members registered. The number of attendees that come does fluctuate anything from 80 down to 20, obviously, because we had a, a last minute change in venue. My apologies for those people that it caused problems, but thank you to those that, that did attend. Uh, myself and the rest of the steering committee, which is made up of uh, the police forces, academia, uh, industry uh, professionals met before this meeting and one of the things that we're looking at and dressing at is how do we strengthen and improve the, the Yorkshire cybersecurity cluster. So just very briefly, sort of the headlines for that is we do now have the, the dates for the next six months of when the uh, meetings will happen and the locations of when they will happen. What was hoped that for this meeting is that we might actually secure uh, a brand new venue and premises but as with these things, when you leave it, a little bit close to the line there are things that move back so hopefully the exciting new venue may come about uh, sort of next uh, next meeting which will physical meeting which will be in September so I say we have the dates the times and locations for the next meeting so they'll be shared with you after this they'll also be shared on the YCSC website and also through social media um, and we do ask that if you you know if you have any feedback or any comments then please let us know we do have an administrative team that are actually going to be contacting all the members over the next couple of weeks just to try and ascertain what time location suits you guys best as professionals and is there anything in particular topic wise you want to get out of it that's about as much as I'm going to go over because you're not here to speak to, here to listen to my voice and what we have is a number of, of information about what's happening in the region from a cyber security perspective and we're also very very privileged to have um, Ian from Ian Glover from Crest over today to talk to you about something that's happening in the industry. For those of you that don't know Ian, as I explained him as sort of the godfather of cybersecurity, as the 12 years that I've been in the industry, he has been in it excelling in what he's doing from a, a national and international level, but I'll let him do his, his introduction far better than I could. So what do we have? Um, so just to, just a reminder of what the vision for the cluster is to make the best use of Yorkshire talent and skills. Um, there's, I'm not standing in my own dots. Um, there is a, an element that we want to sort of represent the North as a centre of excellence. And there's a number of work that we touched on in the steering group that's happening in the region. So if you want to have a more active role in that, then please let us know if you want a more active role in the steering committee and looking at how we turn this into a centre of excellence, then please let myself or Mike know. Just, actually, with the steering committee, can you just put your hands up in the air and give a quick wave? just so that you know if you can't catch me or grab me um, then those guys are here as well to help you okay and to share best practice we can move on that's pretty much what I've covered okay in the news I'll hand over to, to Tom so Tom, for those of you who don't know, generally does a bit of a, a news snippet as what's happening. Tom is on placement with Bob's business um, and he's coming to an end now. So we're a little bit top heavy. We've got our two new uh, information security placement students at the back of the room. You've got Elliot and Beth. Hi, say hi. So they'll be taking on some of the administrative function for the, for the YCSC as well and picking up the news. So they're here to learn. So feel free to test and, and, and push their knowledge as well. Okay, Thank you very much.